My name is Hannah Reichel. I'm Associate Professor of Reformed Theology at Princeton Theological Seminary. Under the title, The Near, the Far, and the Other, I will argue that Bart gives us two different models to map the space of the political. In the longstanding definition of the political by way of a friend-enemy distinction, we always end up otherizing and excluding an other. Thinking of God as the holy other with Bart allows us to throw the burden of otherness onto God. It allows us to relativize all inner human differences vis-a-vis -vis this holy other. This model is quite potent for ideology critique, for example, against Christian nationalism. It also comes at a price. It introduces a homosocial dynamic between God and man at the cost of woman. Christ's incarnation overcomes the ultimate otherization by God becoming the human being's concrete other. But it is no accident that Bart then defines the matrix of our co-humanity by compulsory cis heterosexuality. But there is a second model in Bart for mapping out the political, and it is found in his doctrine of election. In an act of kenotic solidarity, God elects God's self to be the God for the human being, and Bart conceptualizes this as the going of the sun into the far country. This model does not negate difference, but it also does not rely on authorization. Kenosis does not insist on sameness. Neither shared experience nor shared identity need be the condition of possibility for unity. Rather, kenosis enables solidarity in contextual, concrete, yet open boundaried negotiations. Hegemonic homosociality and kenotic solidarity as models of the political. I look forward to our conversation. <laughs>